Okay. Welcome back to Less Cash More Mash. My name's Tom. My name's Mike. Today, happy St. Patrick's happy Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day to all. It's actually going to be tomorrow when this comes out. It will be St. Patty's Day, but we figured we'd give you a little something. And today, we went with Irish. Irishly so. So, we are doing Dunville. Dunville, 1808. Very clear. It is actually. It is. It is actually. But then again, no, no. It's very clear. Isn't that what, is Jameson clear like that, though? Uh, I think no, it comes out. Green, it's in a green bottle. It's in a green bottle, but when you pour it, I think it comes out Could be. Uh, like crystal clear, too. But anyway, Dunsville was actually born in 1808, and then uh, there was actually a family tragedy that made them lay dormant for like 80 years, and they were reborn back in 2012 when they were bought out by the Ecklinsville Distillery. Uh but for over a hundred years, they were uh, among the finest in the world's best known Irish whiskeys out there. Uh, and it actually said on the bottle uh, that they actually, most of Belfast, their trains and their, uh, you know, their parks. The football. Every, you, you name it. And most the of Belfast. Yeah, was built. W yeah, was actually built by this company. So... And then when it was laying dormant for years, I, you couldn't get a bar. I guess you had to get it at like an auction or anything. They weren't selling it for like a, a ton of years. So um, did we ever find out? Did you ever see the? I don't recognize the bottle. Like, I don't know I, if this is something you find in, in bars. Uh, uh, again, the bar days are kind of over. And then right, right. Do we, I don't, I didn't pay attention to them. Yeah, I just, it's I, not I was like, a rum and coke drinker. Yeah, I mean, you always, time. like, when you look at it, because I always looked at the bar when you're waiting for a drink, and uh, and you're like, no, oh, there's Jameson, you know, you know, there's certain ones you see yeah, all the yeah, time. Yeah. That I just don't recognize this one, but, it, hey, it's it been around. We, we it's probably around. will now. We probably will now, if if I ever go back. <laughs> <laughs> but, I should, then I, I probably will this. now. I was going to say, yeah. So, we're going to give this a try. Um, we have recently... It actually would probably be the last episode we did with Powers. Uh, I think it's the last one that we just put out. So we do have a reference point where if we have a question. Which was easy drinking. It was actually, yeah, and it was actually very good. I remember being uh, pleasantly shocked by the amount of flavor that actually came out of it. I, I was actually pretty, pretty impressed. Because there's another one that been around for a billion years right. and uh, right. didn't seem to... It doesn't carry the... When someone says Irish whiskey, you know, you hear the... Another tell one that we, we talked about that. Yeah. Another bottle we really didn't see. Right. Ooh, this is a different smell, too. It is a different smell, but I don't know what it is again. Once again. It's smelling easy, though. It, it, smell, it, it has, like, a know, very no light... No mad punch nope. in the smell. No, I can go right in it. But it's and it's not a vanilla because the last one, if yeah. I remember correctly, had like that vanilla. In fact, wasn't I getting a butterscotch? A little, of, you nope. say, yeah, I think it was butterscotch. I'm uh, I'm going for a sip. I'm gonna have to because it's gonna have <laughs> to wake up my thing. It's smelling very light. Hmm. What was? We didn't look. I didn't look. What is the proof on this? It's very, very yeah. light. No tingle. No, there was no tingle on the tongue whatsoever. But I, I kind of just, I, I kind of drank this one down. 80 proof. Because, uh, when, you know, that first sip, I was just trying to coat my mouth. So I'm going to, I'm going to give it a minute and then I'm going to try to go back in and actually like get it in there to it's, see what it's, it actually, it's actually does. It's very, very nice. I think. To me, it kind of... What, what the flavor, I it, don't know. It kind of reminded me a little bit, drinkability-wise, it reminded me of the Canadian one, how it just went right down. Like, there was, like, no bark back at all. Like, the, you know what I mean? Like, you wouldn't even know this wasn't 30 proof. You know, that, right. like, it just... Uh, like, drinking a glass of water. Like, it, there was no... But I didn't get any tingle on my tongue or anything. No, yeah. no. Not even in the back. Not even, not even like, a, a warm. No. But we didn't really have... Powers didn't knock us out either. No, no, it was very, so, very. Is this triple distilled? Powers was triple distilled, and I, I think that's think, what helped to the. I don't, I don't think, think it, it said on uh, the. Uh, Let's see the research we do. Yeah, there you go. No, I try to give you fun <laughs> facts. You can read anybody can read the bottle when they buy yeah, it. You know what I mean? You can see. I know Powers said it was triple distilled, and I think that added to that really. It's a pot, a blend of pot still. Yeah, that was pot still too. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, single pot. It doesn't say no. 
I'm guessing it's probably one. You know what I get? I get it. When you taste it, do you get any smoke? I didn't really get, I just ate smoke. I don't really get any smoke. No, you should definitely get right because you just had a, some of the stuff some, I just yeah, made. I, yeah. I don't really. I, don't. I do. Now, when, because you weren't a scotch guy, when I, when I was drinking scotch and I was drinking the cheap scotch, you get that hint of smoke and that's exactly what I get. Like I get a little, which would be the peat. Like you get a little peaty, like a smoky flavor like in the background on the tail sweet. end. Smelling wise, I do. But I'm talking right at the, when you take your next sip, right at the very end, I get a little bit like if it was lightly smoked. I'm getting like a, maybe almost like the, like the, 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 it might even be the char in the barrel that actually, I assume it, it, it's in it, you know, that actually is finally coming in because it's so light. It's a light smelling. It, it, you don't get a, the brown it's sugar. Like, it's, it's not it's, a. It's more like a, like a, like a liquid, not, not, no brown sugar, more mm -hmm. like just like a. A sugary, something sugary, but almost flower esque. I almost get like a floral with a smoke. It, it's almost like when I drink my teas. Like I'm almost getting like 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 one of the jasmine tea floral when I just swish it in, in my mouth there, and then it comes down at the very tail end. You get a smoke on it. Yeah, you'll little, see the next time we when it, we do a scotch. It, it, it's it, an easy drinker, smooth as silk. <laughs> but the very tail end, it reminds me of like a aftertaste if you ever smoked a cigar and it just sit you know you get that that aftertaste in your mouth but the scotch has it does, that it does linger there is like a flavor that lingers but it's not a burn no no it, it to me it, it gives me that cheap scotch like when i drank the real cheap scotch it was just a hint of smoke you didn't get a lot of smoke flavor and I, that's what i was liking about it because it gives you that extra taste in it and uh this is actually really good this one's actually really good very... oh we just lost the leprechaun <laughs> Um, uh, antics. Yep. There you go. Silly tricks. He got mad at us. He's out. <laughs> he, he didn't like our outfits. But, uh, yeah. we tried to lighten it up. Yeah. Is it, there any, uh, <laughs> he's looking for the gold. That's it. That's it. If he finds it back there, I'm going to need some, you know. He had to finish this project. Yeah, exactly. Overall, I, you know, it's very good. I like it. Do I like it better than Powers? That was good. I, this is, I this like is this. very it's, drinkability. It's, 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 it's six of one, half a dozen of another on this one. I think it's totally different on, you know, it's the same, but it's different. Like, to me, I like that secondary. There was no smoke flavor in that one. This is light it was, it was, on the nose. It was still, it's very light on the nose, like no alcohol. And you know all. what? Now that I'm smelling it more, it almost reminds me of when I used to get... Uh, I'm gonna have to look at the, the cheap, I'm gonna have to get it one day. I used to buy a handle of cheap scotch, again, under 20 bucks for its 1.75 liter. And it had a, a light smoke. And uh, that's what this smells like, it really does. Oh, it didn't say cool. anything, I don't have, that's my glasses, does it Does it say the mash bill on it? I wonder if it's a high rye or- I don't think it broke it down. Or something like that. The Spirit of Belfast. I just kind of, um, let me see. A blend of pot still, malt, and grain whiskeys. Confident, uncommon. You know what? So, I, so it's a grain? Yeah, I really like this. I really do. I do like the label. I like that it has stuff on Information. it. Information? Yeah, it's got the, the city it, right it, there. It it's actually, it, it's actually, you know, it, it runs its namesake, which is really nice. Um, overall. Which, it, which everybody's different, as you see. But yeah. It, this it, is really informative. It's nice. We have was it Holy Boy or whatever? Didn't have nothing. It, it, it yeah. Yeah, there was a couple of them. Where Scatterbrain had absolutely it had a picture of, a, of an elephant. You know when they did the peanut butter. You know, so it didn't have a lot on it. But uh, you know, I was assuming because when the, I, I haven't I had thought it was gonna be harsh. I haven't had Jameson in so long, uh, and I used to just throw it on ice and guzzle it down when when I would get it. But um, this really has a lot, what I remember it being, I, when we started doing the Irish ones, I'm gonna confess, much like the Canadian ones, I found them drinkable and easy, but not, you know, you get mm, so much more flavor out of the bourbons is what I used to think. I really like this one. This one reminds me of, of, of a scotch. And I wanna say, I say cheap scotch because of the minimal amount of smoke, but this is smooth as silk and, 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 yeah. and 
and and tastes absolutely delicious. There is a, I can't get that. It's almost flower esque and it's it's light to me. I I can't tell you the but it's. it's I'm trying it's, to think. It's, it's an it's, easy drink. If what like if it smells like a candy, or something I've had, sugary. It but is not, it, not, it, not it, brown sugar. It, though. No, no, not not brown sugar at all. Right? It, maybe it's, maybe it's if like you just took like a. I can't think. Of, you, know, you mix sugar and water or something. Yeah, yeah. You know when you're doing your for the hummingbirds. Mm-hmm. It just I I kind of get like a hint of that. You definitely get that that smoke taste at the end, and it sits on your tongue, and it's actually delicious. And it almost, like, the instant, it, it gives you, like, that, it, you ever do bean boozle when you get, when you eat, like, that, that the bean boozles, they're nasty, nasty <laughs> beans, but they, they, they have, like, one of them's, like, like, cut grass, or one of them's baby where, white. Where are these? Oh, you, they, they, it's a game, and you oh. spin a dial, and uh -huh. you gotta take a black one, and it's either black licorice or skunk smell. And oh, it's, it's, it ain't nothing nice. It's, it's a bad game. But some of them Can't are like, it's either mint or you eat like cut grass. And, so and it literally takes, that's the bean, bean boozled. Yeah, it's called bean boozled. So you get it. And when you get the, the little hint of smoke, it almost reminds me of the cut grass one. Like it just kind of lingers on your, on, your, on your tongue. It's not, this one isn't heavy smoke by any means because some of them are going to be like real smoky. But this one, I really like it. Total different very, very powers. Easy. To me, it, it is. Like, it's like not even. It's like night and day. Like it, it has nothing. It, it's this. It's, it's, this it's I think smoky. would hold up better in in like a it, with with if you're gonna mix it because I think that smoky taste would fight through. Like I always wondered if the scotch is. You don't taste that, huh? The smoke. No, that's the flavor I'm getting. Again, I just got done eating it, so. Yeah, I, yeah, you did. Did have so that, I'm the turkey. So. I probably, I already smoked it out. Mm hmm. Mm. I like it a lot. I'm just thinking if we, if we blinded it and we went against powers, I think we'd be able to pull this one out. This was only, I think this so. one's I, almost like a scotch. I think it's more. This is more like it, a scotch. It, it's lighter. Yeah. It's it's a, like it, it's an easier drinker. I think. Well, powers was by no means a, a tough drinker either. No, it was. It was I thought it was super smooth, but again, you know, um, th this reminds me reminds me a lot of a scotch. I I really like this one. I really like it. And they're both in a it clear. doesn't remind me of a long time ago. Here, oh, yeah. so there is, it is totally different color. Total different in color. Just, I just want to see the difference in, in smells. Like it doesn't even remind me the same. This has much more. Much more what? Smell? Yeah, we just poured that one though, so it wasn't no, really fair. Okay. But, um, cause this is on my yeah, glass, like my and that one's really not on the glass. Um, but again, you don't have that blast of alcohol in with, with this one either. No, no, it's super, super soft. Like it's really good. This one may have a little more fruit like. No, like this one is a, it's light and soft and almost reminds me of, of like flower-esque, not a strong flower either, like just a hint. Not like when you get a bouquet and you're like, whoa, hello, you know, those are strong, like, like, a, like an old flower that's been sitting around. No, not lilac or anything that's going to knock you out, you know, but just a little, like a, like the baby's breath that you, you can't really smell mm, unless you're right in it. Nose, it. Yeah, yeah. I, I really like the smell. It does have definitely to me. It does almost, you almost do get that now. When you go like that, you almost get a, like a light fruit. Now that you said that, that. I don't know if it, you do. And I, I, that one to me is, I'm, it's it's almost like hummingbird. It would be like a light When fruit. you do the mix, oh, like, hummingbird. Not that it smells peach, but it would be like a light fruit. Like a, like a, you know. I can't tell you the fruit, but it's to me, right, it smells gonna, a little fruit. You get your own, so I'm going to try Side by side. This this is what I this reminds me of the traditional Irish. Like when I used to drink Jameson, it gives you that, it gives you the taste, burn. and it gives you the 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 Jameson has a little more burn. I thought. Well, that, that yeah, but this gives a little more burn than that. Then that one, yeah, 
it but it gives you that flavor and it's it's like a that's why I said it reminded me of a Canadian where it's not the complex flavors of the bourbons. It's just nice and smooth. This right here, I guarantee when we have a scotch, you're going to be like, yep, yeah, that was the taste when, cause it'll be magnified. This is, gives you that hint. And I wonder if they, if they smoke their barley or something, if they, if they do something different to give it that little smoky flavor. Although it wouldn't be as light. I wouldn't think. You think? No, the scotch. Yeah. Cause moonshine comes out straight. Uh, it comes out. So yeah. if it's not if if it's not if they don't put any color in it because some people color it, and it doesn't sit in a barrel because uh, it's not a bourbon, so it doesn't have to actually sit in a barrel. If it doesn't sit in a barrel and absorb the the color from the barrel, it'll stay light. Yeah. You know, I don't know how long if they even age it at all. You know what I mean? If it's just distilled and you drank it, then it won't have that uh, color. Color. I mean, because it. I mean, it's. It is super light, even compared to this one, which was right. relatively light. Right. But if it's not sitting in the oak barrel, it's not going to absorb. If you guys try this, you let me know. This, this to me, is a, is a, a lightly smoked scotch. That's what it reminds me of. I mean, Ireland and Scotland, they, they, they kind of coincide anyways. Oh, a lot of the, no, 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 <laughs> not, not, not family wise and not that. But w when it came to booze, they, they, I want to say the Scottish people learned from the, I, I think I did research at one point and they had said that most of the Scotch came from like the, 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 the actual, what they do. But a lot of these, the different pots and they distill it like multiple times where the Scottish, they don't, they only usually still it, distill it once and stuff like that. But that's what this reminds me of. And maybe this is why they, they got rid of that. that uh, and it's, it, uh, again, it's all going to depend on the mash. You know what I mean? You put a little bit yeah. more rye than something else, and all of a sudden... It's you have rye, right? This one didn't uh, No, I, I don't think... It's, it said oats and something right. else. So Maybe that's... And, and that's weird if it has oats and we're not smelling it like every, everywhere else. We well, because I keep smelling the oatmeal, but I don't smell that in no, this one. No. I really do well, smell... That's, I'm not, I don't have that one anymore. But. Although, no. If you go... Like smell the end of the bottle. There's a there's a hint of the oat in the end. Mm -hmm. There's a hint of the oatmeal. Now that it, it, and again we we drink it right down. If we let it sit and we you know pause the thing for like ten minutes, I bet it would open up a lot more and we get it. But I I think it's delicious. Do we remember what it was? Can you see that? No, because I certainly can't. Um, price rise seven fifty milliliter. Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. You can't beat that with a stick. I think that's absolutely delicious. Um. Again, it reminds me a lot. So if anyone else agrees with me, leave a comment down below. If you disagree with me, leave a comment down below because I, 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 I could be, but it really does give you that smoky flavor. And, and, and I almost want to do, next time we do one, do a scotch so you get the, you can tell the difference on the, uh, not that you, you don't know, but you'll definitely taste that on the tail end. Very easy drinker. Powers is good, but I think I, I just like that. It's just a secondary, you know, cause you do, it does have a nice light, and I thought so, it was going to be blah, and it's not. No, it's it's easy, and it's 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 very good. I like yeah, it. The the color is deceiving because you think the darker the better, but not, it's not, not always not the case. That I'm against no, a and a half, no, so no. This one, easy. this one's actually really good. But uh, um, I I I think it gave it a little twist that that it did made it set above. From what I remember, and I haven't drank in a million years. And they're both, I think, oh, that's like 88 or something. That's This is 80. 80. But what I remember, I, I, I want to say Jameson is usually around 80, too. I think it I is. Think it is. So I think it is. what I remember of that one, it, it wasn't half the flavor, but we're going to have to get one and, and compare. Because uh, you can't, can't really do it uh, as through memory like that. Cause it was, and I used to water it down anyways with the yeah. ice cubes. So. Yeah. But overall... I, I would highly recommend this one. Very much. Especially for the price. Nineteen ninety nine. you can't beat that with a stick. Nope. And, Easy uh, drinker. You know, um, you know, I can see why they've been around for, for centuries. And, um, and uh, I, I'm impressed. No, no. Very good. So there you go. Uh, Dunsville, 1808. I mean, it, that, that's some time. They've been around a while. So uh, I don't know if they have a variety of that or if this is their namesake well, and that's all better. they have. But uh, overall, this is delicious. I can't imagine that's the only one. I doubt it, especially where they were rebought by a whole other distillery. I'm assuming that, you know, they must have their own, you know, we'll probably Something come across, especially if we, we do, uh, you know, more Irish and more Scotch, yeah. I'm sure we'll come up with something else that they have. But or, they, again, if you know of it, leave a yes. comment down below. Absolutely. And uh, look into it. There it is. So there is our review.
So once again, spend less, drink more. Thanks for Cheers. watching. Cheers.